Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com, and we've got a free pick in Friday morning Korean baseball coming up. Game goes at 5.30 a.m. Eastern. We'll get to that in just a moment. If you've yet to become a member, DocSports.com, just want to jump on board and give it a trial run. Click on the link below the video, get set up for a free $60 account, which you can use on any of my daily packages or anybody else at DocSports.com. Again, all you got to do, click on that link below the video. Real quick college football news. The Big Ten announced earlier on Thursday that they're looking to play a football season, but within the conference. So potentially, you know, not as many games. Obviously, all the games would be played within the Big Ten. And we've kind of heard that for a lot of the big Power Five conferences, the SEC, the ACC. Not sure the Pac-12 is going to be involved this year. We'll see how that plays out. Uh, but at least they're going to try to give us something as far as college football is concerned. And uh, hopefully that'll play out and come to fruition that we'll at least get inter conference uh, games where we are seeing uh, conference teams playing against each other this fall in college football. And then, you know, what the talk is, bowl season is out. Uh, potentially, there could be a Final Four. So uh, I'm sure you guys are all abreast of that. We'll chime in where we find new information. And that was the information made widely pub public on Thursday afternoon. Also wanted to mention, uh, I passed on Friday morning KBO play as far as premium picks are concerned. Going to give you the play here in just a moment. Uh, we did cash our loan play on Thursday. It's already in the books and it was soccer action. We played Manchester United to win by shutout. Uh, it was plus a dollar five when we first jumped on this one and they did so. They won 3 0. Uh, so a nice win again in soccer as we continue uh, to rack up the profits on the pitch. And I've got an elite level play going on Friday, so don't miss out on that. Soccer available Friday, 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific. And Saturday morning, KBO will be available on Friday at 3.30 p.m. Eastern time. You can purchase those before the games even come out, uh, and then you'll get the games along with them. So that's all over on my homepage at DocSports.com. We've got a big weekend. we got UFC going on Saturday. We've got NASCAR going on Sunday. We'll talk about those each of the next couple of days. All right, let's get to our free pick. And by the way, if it looks like I'm leaning a little bit to one side, uh, my tripod uh, just decided to kind of lose a little grip and is drifting downward in one direction, but we should be able to make it to the video. Uh, anyway, we got Ki Woom taking on Kia, and in this particular matchup, we do like that pitching edge. We've got Wante Choi going for Ki Woom. We've played him a couple of times this particular KBO season, and he has some personal revenge on his mind, not against Kia, but just in that his last start was one of two weak starts. For, he's only had two bad starts this entire season. Uh, going into that last start over the weekend, he had a 3 6 68 one, uh, ERA, 116 whip on the campaign. Uh, but before that particular game, he was rolling. And he's had two rough starts, as we mentioned. The last time that he had tough starts, in fact, the last two times, he's followed it up with a three-game stretch that is tough to match. He had a 2.28 ERA and a buck 22 whip following one bad start over a three start period. 2.28 ERA, 1.22 whip. And before that, his previous week start, he had a 2.37 ERA and an 0.79 whip. He bounces right back. When he has a rough start, they aren't prolonged as far as adding up game after game. He gets right back on track immediately. We like him to do so here. He's laying about a buck 20 right thereabouts uh, with Key Womb, which they've taken the action uh, so far since the line's open. But we like him here. He's going up against a Kia offense that's seventh in scoring, seventh in team batting average. If you're new to the KBO, there's only 10 teams, so they're one of the worst at the plate. And then uh, Hyun Jong Yang is going to go for Kia in this one. His last 14 innings, 14 and a third to be exact, he's been belted for 17 earned runs, 29 base runners, and four home runs. He's got to face the powerful Ki Woom offense. We're going to recommend a play on Ki Woom over Kia. All right, that's a free pick for Friday morning. Game goes at 5.30 a.m. Eastern, 2.30 a.m. Pacific. Don't forget about my soccer play, Elite Play, on Friday. It'll be available on Friday only at DocSports.com. And, of course, we'll be back in KBO action for Saturday morning as I've looked ahead to those probable pitching matchups. That's going to do it for me. Let's go with Ki Woom. If you like the videos, click on that thumbs-up button. Be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Spritz or DocSports.com.